So we just got to the Duke Chrome station and this is how the community is. If you've not seen the community before, you know they are Guans, okay? They speak the the people of Edu Chrome speak the Chepon language, okay? But that Chepon language is is more related to Guan than most of the Ekri languages. Yeah, so this is Dukrum. Those who have not seen the place before. So coming to Dukrum, you pick a car from Medina. Then you go to Pedriase, um, Kitase, Jankama Ebri, Obusumase, way up to two. I'm not chrome, I'm not fair. Okay, don't get to a crow corner, so you are more closer to the Guans now. So the Guan communities likely start from a crow pond, a brew, the who? Latte. Okay, so this is a Guan community. So this is how the community is. <laughs> So you see, so you see the place like very, very, very beautiful. Typical village setting. If you are here, proper oxygen, like less carbon dioxide. See. Like, in the future, I have to come and stay here because this place, oh God, the air is just cool. Ah, like yeah, good oxygen, not any carbon dioxide. See ah. trees. Uh, yeah. So yes, one, one may ask, what's the history behind the name Edu Chrome? Edu Chrome simply means Edu Town. Okay, that's the one most people know. But then, according to other school of thought, it is said that ten people established this place. So Edu Krote. Okay, that's another school of thought. So basically, this is all what we have. So from here we go to Aprede, then it continues. So catch you later. Uh, okay. Okay. What? No work, but now what would you try? Any work, but